ओके स्टैंडर्ड क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन ओके सो दे आर डिफरेंट इन फॉर्म बट अ जनरल इक्वेशन कैन बी कन्वर्टेड टू स्टैंडर्ड स्टैंडर्ड कैन बी कन्वर्टेड इनटू अ जनरल इक्वेशन दैट डिपेंड्स ऑन द व्हाट इज गिवन इन द प्रॉब्लम ओके because sometimes if uh, given the standard you can easily identify where is the vertex what is the length the rat latus rectum and all the elements you can find it and by the general equation you can solve it by a uh, formula okay otherwise you have to transform it to standard equation okay since parabola is a conic section okay the standard equation of a conic section is a x squared check our first uh, our previous videos a x squared plus b x y plus a b c c y squared a b c d d x plus e y uh, plus f equals zero. Okay, this is a standard equation of a conic section. So, therefore, since a parabola is a conic section, you can determine that this is equation. Is a parabola if if b squared minus 4ac is equal to zero. Okay, so if it is an ellipse, if it is an hyperbola, you can determine from this equation if given the absence of uh, given the presence of b. Okay. You can determine that this is a parabola if you solve the b squared minus 4ac is, is equal to zero. Then this is a parabola. Parabola. Like for example, maybe if the equation is um, let's say x squared. Okay, let's for, for example only uh, x squared plus uh, 2yx at uh, 2xy. Okay, 2yx plus uh, y squared. Uh, say plus uh, 3x plus uh, 5x 5y minus 3 for example 0 okay this is your a b c d e and f okay if you can determine that this is a parabola if b squared your b is 2 squared minus 4 times the value of a1 times the value of c is 1 also that is equal to 0 so this is 2 squared is 4 minus 4 times 1 times 1 that is 4 equals 0 so 0 equals 0 so therefore uh, this is a parabola okay now if uh, another standard form of the uh, Another standard equation of parabola is if b is equal to 0. If b is equal to 0. Okay. If b is equal to 0, it's either a or c is equal to 0. They cannot be uh, they cannot be uh, there uh, uh, together okay so it means to say that a x squared plus dx plus e y plus f equals zero okay or uh, y uh, sorry c y squared plus dx plus e y plus f equals zero so I use the word or because either of these is an equation of parabola, but you cannot, you cannot, uh, you cannot say that uh, there is a presence of x squared and y squared in one equation. Okay, what's the meaning of b equals zero? It means to say that the axis, okay, this axis, the axis of symmetry, uh, sorry, axis of symmetry is uh, parallel with x and y axis i repeat the meaning of b equals zero the axis of symmetry is parallel with x and y axis okay so this is the general equation of a parabola what about the standard equation of a parabola 
Okay? This standard equation of parabola or what we call the vertex form. In vertex form. Okay? If uh, if the vertex of the parabola is if the vertex is at 0 0. Okay? Meaning our parabola is here. It's either it opens upward, downward, to the left, or to the right. Okay? So, if the vertex is equal to 0, 0, its standard form is uh, x squared is equal to uh, 4ay. Okay? This form, uh, if this is the form of the uh, equation, the parabola opens upward. If uh, x squared is equal to negative 4ay, this opens downward. If y squared is equal to 4ax, this opens to the right. And if y squared is equal to negative 4ax, okay, it opens to the left. This is the form, okay? We will dis further discuss about this, uh, what is 4a, okay? Uh, about, about this form, okay? Just just accept for the meantime that these are the, the uh, standard equation of the parabola. Later on, because we will discuss first about the elements of the parabola for you to understand what are this a, okay? Okay, at the end of this video, we, you, I, I will put the link about uh, this topic. Okay, next, if your vertex is at the H and K, okay, usually they denote the vertex to be as H and K, not X and Y, I don't know, okay, but uh, it's better for us to follow, uh, they denote it as X, uh, H, K, okay, so if the vertex is uh, at H, K, okay, uh, the equation will be we will just follow this okay by x minus h okay because this is the x right this is the x and this is the y this is x minus h squared is equal to 4 a y we will be writing like y minus k okay x in terms of x and y in terms of y second x squared x minus h squared is equal to negative 4 okay the second one negative 4a uh, y minus k so it's the same thing also that this the first one is opens upward okay and the second one is opens downward Next, the third one is y squared will be y minus k squared is equal to 4a x. Okay, x will be x minus h. Okay, this opens to the right and the y minus k squared is equal to negative 4a times x minus h. This opens to the left. It is very important for you for reviewees, okay, the civil uh, engineering board exam, or other uh, or other uh, profession with the uh, mathematics, to uh, <clears throat> to uh, memorize, okay, memorize this standard equation, because this is very important to be used in integral calculus or what, uh, subjects in calculus. Okay, because by this equation you will see, uh, you will know immediately where is the vertex. For example, here, this is the vertex now, H and K. Okay, if the problem given this form, you know that the vertex is at H and K. Okay, you will know the latus rectum because 4A will be the latus rectum. Okay. What is this latus rectum? Okay, uh, we will discuss now. Okay, check this uh, the video link 
at the end of this video we will discuss about the elements of the parabola so that we will understand this equation okay so i repeat this general equation is can be converted into standard and the standard can be converted into general and in finding the vertex or, or elements of this you can find it in the equation and by here if this is the given you can find it by formula okay we will discuss it later on okay so that's all for this uh, topic please don't forget to subscribe please thank you